Hey, I'm Bruce Bourne, and you're watching Titan Sports Recap. Bam! Tonight on Titan Sports Recap, men's basketball gets invited to the collegeinsider.com tournament, and they'll match up with Loyola Marymount University in the first round. We've got highlights and an analysis of their entire season. Titan baseball battles rainy weather and their rivals, Long Beach State Dirtbags. And we have the results from the Judy Garmin Classic. All this and more on Titan Sports Recap. Hello and welcome to Titan Sports Recap, bringing you the best video coverage of Cal State Fullerton Athletics. I'm Corey Vest. And I'm Alyssa Santiago. After failing to make the NCAA tournament, men's basketball was invited to compete in the CollegeInsider.com tournament. They make their sixth Division I postseason appearance as they travel to Loyola Marymount University. Ashley Correa is there with the results. Hey Alyssa, so Fullerton comes off an upset last week against UCI in the Big West Conference tournament. They had the honor to be invited to the college um, insider.com postseason tournament against Loyola Marymount without the help of their starter, Isaiah Mopig. Let's check out the highlights. After a disappointing loss to UC Irvine in the first round of the Big West Conference tournament, the Titans look to rebound in the college insider.com tournament against Loyola Marymount University. Titans down two in the opening minutes, and DJ Seeley gets the Titans going by knocking down the three ball. Titans take the lead, 3-2. Moore Seeley in the first half, collects the miss by John Underwood, goes back up, won't go, gets his own miss, and finally puts it in with the foul. 32 points for Seeley on the night. But LMU runs away with the game in the second half. Anthony Ireland strips Kwame Vaughn and goes to the distance for the layup. The Titans can't gather the loose ball, and the Lions go on for a little showtime action. Godwin Akanji takes it himself and hammers it home. LMU advances to the second round of the CollegeInsider.com tournament with an 88-79 victory over Cal State Fullerton. DJ Seeley comes off tonight with 32 points. Fullerton ends their season 21-10. From Loyola Marymount University, I'm Ashley Correa at Titan Sports Recap. The Titans are done for the year, but they are looking very strong going into next season. Notable returners include two of their all Big West starters, and the TCU transfer Sam Yeager will be eligible. For more on men's basketball, here's Ben Mikowski. Titan Baseball takes on Long Beach State Dirtbags in a three-game series. They won the first game and Torrey Brown is at Goodwin Field with the results of Game 2. The Titans had a last-minute schedule change with a doubleheader. They won the first game 2-1 to one, and now have a nightcap. Titans Baseball heads into their Long Beach series with a 13-1 record against the 49ers since 2009. After five appearances, Titans start freshman Kenny Matthews on the mound. First batter of the game, Johnny Bakakis is struck out looking. With a runner on second, Long Beach's Jeff Yamaguchi goes down swinging. Top of the fourth, Brennan Metzger with a sack fly to Ivory Thomas. Eno Patron scores from third for Long Beach's first and only run. Bottom of the fourth now with bases loaded. Derek Legg at the plate. He is hit by the pitch, allowing Carlos Lopez to score the Titans' first run. The next batter is Chad Wallet. He comes up with a sack fly to deep left. Anthony Hudding scores from third. K 
Kenny Matthews at it again. Royce Murray is struck out looking. That leaves Matthews with six strikeouts, allowing only one run off of five hits and no walks. The Titans sweep the Long Beach doubleheader with identical two to one scores. I felt good, you know, we, we, had a, we had a game plan going in, we executed pitches, defense played well, we swung the bat, answered when they scored, and that's, that's all we can really ask for. It was a good day. Um, same thing as today, just throwing strikes, just grinding out at bats and playing Titan baseball, and that should be enough to get us one tomorrow. Despite multiple missed scoring opportunities, the Titans came out with a 2-1 victory over the Dirtbags. They advanced to 2-0 in the series and 12-6 overall. From Goodwin Field, Tory Brown, Titan Sports Recap. The Titans won the three-game series despite losing the final game 7-2. Titans softball hosted Judy Garmin Classic. They lost game one 16-0 against Notre Dame. Ashley Asordia has the highlights for game two against Purdue. I'm here at the Anderson Family Field where the Titans softball team looks to gain their first victory in their doubleheader game at the Judy Garmin Tournament after losing to the Fighting Irish 16-0. All-State Fullerton faces the Purdue Boilmakers in the second game of the Judy Garman Classic Tournament. Action in the bottom of the first, Eliza Crawford up to bat grounds the ball down the middle and Adriana Martinez gets the first run of the game, Titans lead 1-0. In the bottom of the third, Eliza Crawford shot to right field and hits a two-run, Titans tie up the game at three. Base is fully loaded for Purdue and Ashley Corney hits a home run. Boilmakers lead 8-3 at the top of the fourth. Titans try to rally at the bottom of the fifth. Titans lose 8-6. Coming off a win against Utah State, the Titans failed to gain a victory in tonight's doubleheader against Notre Dame and Purdue. The Titans trailed Purdue throughout the whole game but weren't able to make a comeback. The Titans face Arizona on March 16th. From Anderson Family Field, Ashley Sordia, Titan Sports Recap. Due to the ongoing rainy weather, the rest of the Juni Garmin tournament was canceled. The Titans finished the tournament 0-2. And here's your Titan timeline, highlighting the biggest games coming in the next two weeks. Titan Lacrosse hosts Western Washington for their senior night on March 21st. Titan Baseball takes on Oral Roberts for a three-game series from March 22nd to the 24th, before starting Big West Conference action against Cal State Northridge for another three-game series on March 30th through April 1st. And remember that you can catch our entire video highlight library on our YouTube channel. Go to youtube.com slash titansportsrecap. Follow us on Twitter. Our handle is at CSUF Sports Recap. And find us on Facebook for our constant video updates. Just search for Titan Sports Recap. Well, that's going to do it for us. Be sure to check us out in two weeks for our more highlights. For all of us at Titan Sports Recap, I'm Alyssa Santiago. And I'm Corey Vest. See you guys next time.